AC guy 1948 here. I bought me a Milwaukee impact driver M18. Uh, it was on sale at my local Rural King for $99. And I was like, well, how can I pass that up? It had the bigger lithium battery in it. I believe it's a 5 amp hour. But um, I'm going to go ahead and open this. We're going to see what you get. And I need a knife. Okay, <laughs> I just cut the tape. Move it back some, I guess. I see a carry case. Oh, it came in the carry case. Very nice. Now that shows you take a little care in your product. Or not, because there's nothing, no protective. Hmm. Don't know how I feel about that. Let's see what's in the box or in the bag. We have instructions for the charger. The camera don't like them either. We have a charger, which is good because it takes both this style battery and I can't remember what the other style is. Uh, is M12, M18 and the M12 chargers here, which is really nice because I guess I'm moving to Milwaukee, so I might as well have a charger. I don't know how quick I'm going to be buying stuff, but uh, definitely I guess this is where I'm making my move from that boss stitch. Now the boss stitch is still going strong. I just wanted something with... Uh, well, really, this was just too good a deal to pass up for a hundred bucks. Battery is just about dead. I like that. It has a battery life indicator on it. Red lithium. And here is the tool itself. And a little pamphlet. Nothing but heavy duty. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Oh boy, <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> no, I'm not going to buy every single one of them. Just the ones I need. <laughs> and the rest of the bag, there's a little bit of cardboard in there. Maybe that helped keep things from moving around. So, Yep, the bag, I'll probably never use it. I hate to say it, but I never use bags. My tools sit out or they go in the toolbox. All right. So now we move on to the main event, unless you enjoyed the unboxing, which I know some people do. <laughs> but uh, there's your, your impact gun itself. It's really short. I wish I had the boss stitch in here to compare, but uh, it's a really short, short head on there. Go ahead and flip it on. I like the light. The light stays on after you... Uh, after you pull the trigger. That is nice. That is a good setup. Alright. How long does the light stay on though? That's the other question. Because, I mean, it's an LED. It's not really going to kill that. There it goes. It just kind of fades out. That is good. Because, oh, I see it doesn't stay on very long. Make a liar out of me. There you go. So, I like it. I think that's going to come very much in handy with uh, getting into some areas. All right. Well, I think that's going to do it for this video. Um, I'm going to let that battery charge up definitely before I do anything with it. Uh, I don't think I'll do any testing in this video. Expect another one where I'll do um, this against the boss stitch, which really was more, well, can't remember what the exact price. If you were just to buy the Bostitch alone, it would be cheaper than this. But it doesn't come with a big battery. There's not a giant line of tools that go with it. So it's kind of like this is the better way to go. Now the Bostitch, if you're looking for something and you're in a pinch and you need something with power, that has power. This I, I yet to be seen. I don't know how much power it puts off. But that Bostitch, I've done some things with it I couldn't couldn't believe it do. So we'll see. We will definitely see. All right. 
I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching and have a great day.